Hey, mother. What big eyes you have. The better to see you with, my dear. Red Riding of the fairy tale. It's such a good story. This one's had so many different versions and so many different morals. A man bitten is a man cursed! It exists everywhere, but the one common thread through it all is this idea of a little girl going to someone's house and the door opening, and it's not who she expected. In our version of this fairy tale, we go very, very dark, almost like the original tales warning young girls that if you go into that woods, you might be attacked, swallowed whole, murdered. It's a take on Red Riding of the fairy tale, but it's exciting to have a, a mystery, a thriller. Everybody thinks that the moral of the story is one thing in this, but it has changed over generations. I wish you could follow your dreams. It's definitely different and strange, and that's what's so cool. It's kind of almost set in a parallel world. It's similar in many ways, but ever so slightly different. That is not a werewolf. I've always been intrigued by werewolves and folklore. Fire! It's primal and savage. It's that thing that, that lives out there in the dark. I mean, I think everyone wants to peek into the darkness, and the wolf certainly gives you that opportunity. The big bad wolf to me is the fear of not knowing who you're really dealing with. And action. The reveal of the wolf was one of the key elements in this movie because this is a creature that is absolutely mysterious. Get to each other. At first, we really did want it to be almost like a blur. So the wolf becomes terrifying by the fact that you don't see it. And then gradually reveal more and more of the power of the wolf, the look of the wolf, and the character and his abilities. The wolf, the fear, and it's, it's something you all kind of grow up with. And it was something we were really excited to take and kind of modernize it in a way, but yet stay true to the story. And action! Our story is a gothic romantic thriller. It's amazing that she's a modern day heroine in a very, very, very old classic story. Where are you going? To grandmother's. I think she's in danger. The thriller aspect of it was really exciting. It's a great story, you know, don't go into the woods. That holds so much mystery on so many levels. And it's inspiring and haunted and it's dark and kind of weird. It's one of those age-old stories that just begs to be retold.